Hi everyone, I hope that you're all doing well today or rather this week. I thought I would share with you my outfits. So this morning I went to the hairdressers so I wore as you can see quite a simple outfit. So I'm wearing this jumper from Amazon Fashion. It's from the Drop collection. I really like this sweater. It's very simple. It's just a black sweater but I feel like it makes all the difference in an outfit. It makes it look much more sporty and casual so i really like to pair this sweater with shorts like these another thing that i really like about this sweater is the crew neck i don't know it adds a bit of a vibe and i love to pull the sleeves up even though it's quite warm today it's 20 degrees it, there's still a bit of a fresh breeze so for me it's always important um, not to be cold to always cover my arms I don't feel cold on my legs however on my arms when the weather is warm but not that warm to be wearing a t-shirt I like to wear a sweater like this or a jumper or even a cardigan with nothing underneath then so I'm wearing these shorts from Mango I got them last year but they're still available uh, I think so I will put a link uh, down below for you guys for my shoes I'm wearing these uh, slippers from H&M they are Birkenstock inspired and I really really like them they're really comfortable I showed them to you in my last haul um, in my H&M haul and I really like them they're very very light very comfortable and easy to walk in and then for handbag I'm wearing this Bottega Veneta inspiration from Naked again I love the touch of red in this outfit I feel like it adds something a bit different a bit trendy and this is typically what i was saying in my haul where i know that this is a trend i don't necessarily want to spend a lot of money in a handbag that's not going to stay for years um it's just a trend so i'd rather buy the trend in a more cheaper version in terms of jewelry i love this necklace i got it from a small boutique uh, here in lille I can't remember the name of the brand, but I will put it on the screen for you guys. This ring is from Who We Are Shop. It's a jewelry shop. Um, it's a French jewelry shop, basically. Uh, these are my wedding rings. Um, I'm wearing this watch uh, from Captain and Son. It's the Grace. And then I'm wearing these two bracelets again from Who We Are. Um, here, this is my Hermes uh, bracelet. And then these rings are also from Who We Are. These rings are quite old and even the bracelets, but they are gold plated and so they last a really long time I feel and that's it I went to the hairdresser this morning so now I am back to brunette my hairdresser only added one color everywhere basically so my hair is gonna get lighter because it's not like a permanent color I'm not sure what the name is in English but in French we call it patine um, but it's just a color that washes off basically so my hair is gonna get lighter and lighter again especially because I have balayage underneath and that's it so this is my first outfit it's still the same day uh, but it's later in the evening and I thought I'd show you my outfit because it's honestly something that's very out of my comfort zone but I thought I would try something different I got these jeans from Mango a little while ago and I've never actually managed to wear them simply because they are such a different style from what I'm used to especially with the um, the pockets and everything I think they're called cargo pants and for me it's very difficult to style them so I thought this evening let's try something different and let's try to pair them with um, shoes that are a bit more I don't know classy maybe or feminine and I feel like it's working quite well this combination so I got these jeans from Mango the shoes are from Jonac which is a French brand I'm wearing this um, top from H&M old um, I got it a few years ago but you know they sell them everywhere uh, this blazer is one of my husband's who has kindly give it to me it's from a brand called Isaac it's a French brand as well and I paired the outfit with this handbag from Leo et Violette it's a French brand as well I love the handbags this one is a collaboration with an influencer with a, a French influencer called uh, Wendy Swan I really like this handbag they got it in a few different colors and this one was my favorite so that's the outfit for this evening and I'll show you my third outfit uh, tomorrow I'm on my way out and this is what I'm wearing today. So I'm wearing this jumpsuit from Mango. I got it last summer. I got it in a size medium and I like the fact that I got it in the size medium because this way it's a bit more oversized and it's a bit roomier inside. I didn't necessarily want it to be really tight on the waist and shorter. I just realized that I spilled some foundation. At the moment I'm wearing powder foundation, you know, from Bare Minerals. 
and I didn't realize that I spilled some of it on my shorts, but never mind. So for socks, I'm wearing these cute socks from End Other Stories. I love their socks. And what I like about them is that they're really thin and they're perfect for, you know, this time of the year when it's a bit warmer and you do want to wear socks, but you don't want to be too warm on your feet. So I love these. And then for trainers, I'm wearing these uh, from Everlane. I got them last summer i think as well it was part of a collab and i love how the color you know goes from purple to cream or white at the back i really love them and for handbag i'm wearing this small pollen bag i think it's the number nine i'm not too sure so i will put it on the screen i think it's the nine mini and i absolutely love this bag i think it's so so cute as well and it's quite roomy actually inside you can fit a lot of things the only tight part is here at the top but then inside is quite roomy because i know a lot of people have asked me can you fit a lot of things in it but actually you really can so yeah it's it's a really roomy bag um, considering the size of it so that's my outfit for today today we are going to the city center of lille i need to find a gift uh, for father's day because it's father's day on sunday here in france i also need to go get my car cleaned there's something else i need to do but i can't remember right now anyway so i will see you tomorrow for the next outfit Today is a new day. Today is Wednesday and we are on our way to the beach. We're going to Belgium. Um, so because we live in Lille, we are close to Belgium and they have obviously uh, the coast that's near the beach. So we thought we would go there today. Um, it's quite warm today, or at least it's warmer here. Here it's about 26 degrees. However, when you go all the way to the coast, it's a bit colder. I think it's around 21 degrees but we thought it would be nice anyway to go catch some sun just to see just to walk on the beach you know just enjoy a bit of a different scenery uh today is wednesday so ian doesn't have school so we're gonna go the three of us so i'm wearing this um oversized shirt from mango i got it last year uh but you know they have oversized shirts everywhere but i will i will find it because i think it's still um in stock so i will put the link down below i'm wearing this tank top from pull and bear it's a cropped one so that's why i'm wearing a shirt just to cover you know my stomach area i also have these glasses from ray-ban this hat is from lack of colors these shorts are from mango as well i will put them down below um, and then I'm wearing these uh, Birkenstock inspired, well you saw them already yesterday, so I'm wearing the same sandals from H&M and this bag is also from H&M, I got it last summer so I don't think it's still available um, but yeah I'm sure you can find you know many many bags that kind of have the same style so that's my outfit for today to go to the beach and I will see you probably tomorrow Today is Friday, so the last day of the week. I think this might be the last outfit I show you, or maybe the one before last. So I'm wearing this gorgeous, gorgeous blouse from Orta. So it's a French, it's not French, it's technically a Belgian brand. It's French Belgian, and I absolutely love this brand. I took you guys with me when I went to the event, uh, when they had like a pop-up store uh, here in Lille. So this is the Celia blouse. I will put the link down below as well. I love the color. I love everything. I love the little details with the little flowers. I love the sleeves. It's absolutely gorgeous. So I paired it with these uh, shorts from Mango. I got them two years ago, two summers ago, but I'm sure you can find other alternatives. And I will try to link some uh, for you guys. And then for slippers, I'm wearing these from H&M that you saw in my last H&M haul. I love them. They're so minimalistic but then so chic and simple and classy at the same time today i decided to go for this one which is the pollen i think it's the numero 9 i honestly always get them mixed up but i will put the link down below for this one anyway i love this color it's the camel color and then yesterday i got this this is honestly a life changer so basically i'm sure you all know what this is but I've been meaning to buy myself one for such a long time. But the thing is that I couldn't find them anywhere and I didn't know, you know, what brand was, you know, one that had good quality ones. Because obviously I could find 
some but you know like i didn't feel like it was sturdy enough for my phone because obviously iphones now are quite expensive and i found this yesterday when i went to uh, the city center of lille i got it in the shop called memento mori or tori i can't remember i will put the link down below to their instagram page if you want and i absolutely love it it's so handy because i'm always carrying my phone in my hand and it's annoying because i need my hands to be free when i'm doing things so this is perfect and this is adjustable of course so you can shorten the um, the string or you can just leave it like that it's like a rope style i really like it and it's i got it in this uh like champagne color and the details are in gold and the case itself is see-through and the brand in case you want to check it out online because i know that they have an online store it's louvini and now we are on our way out we're going to see a surgeon for a potential rhinoplasty i will tell you guys more about it maybe in a vlog or something but it's so it's not something that i want to do but it's something that i might have to do because i've had a septoplasty before which was just to uh, correct my breathing and I didn't want to do a plastic surgery at the time uh, but what happened is that he kind of ruined my nose especially when you look from underneath so I want to see with a plastic surgeon if it's possible to fix that but anyway we'll see anyway and I'll let you know in a, in a future vlog so that's it for the video I thought I would have time to um, show you guys another outfit however I'm just running out of time and today is the day that the video will go live so I won't have time to show you anymore and so if you do want to see videos like this one make sure to subscribe and also let me know in the comments down below so that I know that you guys enjoy uh, outfits of the week videos anyway I'll leave you here I'll see you very soon take care bye bye <music>